Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, this is a continuation or a quick fix to the first video that I did on installing uh, XAMPP 1.7.7 on Windows 7. I found the uh, not really issue, but the the solution to uh, replace the German to English. Uh, there was a set in settings that I overlooked here. Language was set um, from Deutsch uh, in German here. Um, so all you have to do is really uh, choose English, and that should um, should change everything back to English so that 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 you can read it. Also, what I forgot to point out and mention in the first video is once you have XAMPP up and running on on your computer, the best thing that you want to do, and I like to do this, I have this on my other uh, desktop and laptop, is to navigate to where you installed it. Now, if you installed it on the C drive, which you probably did, you want to go to Computer C drive. In here, you'll see a folder called XAMPP. Um, that folder you do not want to delete or mess with unless you don't want XAMPP anymore. Um, in that folder, and of course I don't have it on my C drive, I have it on my H drive. So if I go to my H drive, the folder that you should see is XAMPP, this folder right here. If you open that, you will see that there are lots of files in here. The one in particular you want to look closely at is this dot is this ht docs folder. If you open that, this is where you want to save um, all your files if you're installing WordPress, XAMPP, I'm sorry, WordPress or Joomla or any other content management system or even a website. You want to make sure that you put it in the ht docs folder. Um, what I like to do is create a shortcut to this folder so that I don't have to keep going into this. So if you want right click and I normally do I don't normally use the create shortcut feature because that normally creates a shortcut for me inside this folder so I'm just gonna hit copy I'm gonna come to my desktop and I'm just gonna right click again and do paste shortcut and what that'll do is that will create a shortcut folder to that htdocs folder here so that I don't have to keep coming back here I just click on this folder and bam, I can go ahead and start uh, installing WordPress, Joomla, uh, any content management system or website or anything that I want to test. I can do it right in here. Um, so uh, that that's what I like to do. Is that a shortcut? Also, when you're finished using XAMPP, you want to stop the services and exit. What that'll do is that'll stop the services, uh, close out of the program altogether, and it'll basically make your computer uh, won't use as, as many uh, uh, services uh, it'd be one less service that your computer will be running at the same time so it'll make your computer speed a little more faster than if you kept it on all the time so other than that um, that's basically all for this tutorial um, and thanks for watching